Hello, Delshawn here, your personal financial coach, Arthur Speaker, and number one debt slayer. And I wanted to go over uh, the cash envelope system that I I use that I also have my clients use if they have trouble overspending or they want to have total control of their money. And so the, and I wanted to walk through the steps how I prepare my envelopes. And so, you guys, thanks for uh, joining in. And so, uh, usually after I have created my budget, right, zero-based budget, meaning that every dollar has assignment, there's no such thing as money left over. So, uh, it's going somewhere. Maybe it's going uh, over to savings or paying debt. So, once I complete... Uh, my budget. I also go look at my variable, variable expenses, meaning that I physically have to go to that location to purchase and to buy it. And so uh, the envelopes that I'm going to uh, fill today are my gas envelope, my entertainment, my sister lock, because my hair is <laughs> it's time for my retighten, my groceries, and then my Christmas envelope. So after I complete my budget, then it's time to fill my envelope. But the first thing I needed to do was number one, complete my budget. And number two is go to the bank and physically, you know, write a check or just um, make a withdrawal of money from your bank. And so I've done that. I have the cash in hand and my cash in hand. And so uh, what I'm going to do is uh, the budget sheets that I use is uh, just a plain budget sheet. Um, it's out of my planner. Well, uh, this is just a loose one, but my planner looks like this and I'm going to has your budget sheets in here. So I'm going to list that in the video, how you can get you uh, uh, my uh, personal control planner available on Amazon. And it goes for 13 months. So meaning it goes from December, to December, and it has um, your budget sheet, your spending log, you have your monthly financial reflection page, you have your calendar, and then you have a, uh, your goal setting sheet. So uh, this is very helpful too. So I will post a link in the video down below how you can get this planner. So now that I have my uh, budget uh, together on my envelopes, and so these are my envelopes right here. Uh, my coworker got these for me at Office Depot for like 50 cents. But you, but you guys, you don't have to run out and buy any money. These envelopes that your credit union uses or your bank uses, you can grab these and fill them, uh, fill them up as well. And you have to spend zero dollars. So all you have to do is just write on the top. Um, what category you're filling, but you don't have to run out and buy anything new. You use what you got because we're all about being money control, right? Money control. So the envelopes I got, I'm going to fill my grocery envelope, my grocery envelope. I'm going to fill my entertainment envelope. I am going to fill my sister locks because I got to get my hair done, right? My sister lock envelope and then my gas envelope, right? And so the point of uh, having envelopes, oh, also my Christmas is, is, is un, um, it's unlabeled, but I know this is Christmas because it's just blank. But the object or the mission for the cash envelope system is to just mainly have total control of your money. So after we fill each envelope, right, we go after we fill each envelope and we have zero left in of an envelope, then the spending stop. We do not take money from one envelope to fill the other envelope. So when just for example, when I go to the grocery store, I'm only taking this envelope. I'm not taking a debit card for backup. I'm going to stick to my budget, right? And so what I have put in my envelope, my uh, grocery envelope is what I'm going to use for that trip. And I don't want to ever go over. I'm always want to be under my budget. So here we go. I'm going to count it out. Gas, since I am staying at home, um, staying at home, right? I just went to uh, self being self employed, so I don't have to make so many trips going back and forth to work, right? And so my my um, gas budget for the month, I'm going is going to be sixty dollars. So here we go, 20, 40, 40 60. Um, my entertainment is a hundred. So here's a, a hundred. Here's a hundred dollar bill. And then to get my hair done, I'm going to estimate $100, you know, with tips. And then for grocery is $120. So here's a $100 bill plus, plus $20. And then for Christmas is a Chris $100 bill. And so what I do is just take um, my groceries, is $120, and I put it in my envelope. And this is what I take for the store. For my sister lock envelope, I go ahead and put a hundred dollar bill in it, and then for um, for 
for the gas for the month. 60. Here's my gas envelope. And then entertainment, because you know it's the holidays. You never know what's gonna what kind of invite that I'm gonna have for Christmas parties and things like that. And so I put a hundred dollar bill in here. And then the last one for Christmas is a hundred dollars. And you probably say, Delshun, how are you gonna spend Christmas with a hundred dollar bill? Well, I love Dollar Tree, so there's a lot of cute knickknacks and, and journals and pens and things like that that I can get my family and I can stay on the budget for a hundred dollars so these are my cute little envelope system again my co-worker gave um purchases for me they was like 50 cent at the office depot but i'm telling you these envelopes also work too right these envelopes from your bank or your or your credit union credit union works the same you guys so this is my cash envelope system that's helped me control my money i'm all about money control so make sure that you pick up my planner my planner on amazon and help you uh have more control right over your money so i will post a link in the back until the next time i will talk to you guys later and remember money control is the new you bye